Yesterday, I had the privilege of being able to talk to one of my friar friends who lives in Brooklyn. As he says, he's in the center of the, the epicenter of the coronavirus. A lot of people there have the virus. Many people have died. He talked about people being afraid to go out shopping. And he said sometimes in the dark of night, he'll take a walk because he really can't do that during the day and walk the streets right around where he lives. And he said to me, you see the rats running around hungering for food and you hear the call and the whistles of the drug dealers. As I thought about that later and reflected on that situation, the darkness that is going on there, I was opening my blinds this morning and the light came flooding in and I thought, the light of a new day. It all connected with me, the resurrection. Christ breaks through in this darkness and brings light and hope and peace. We all experience darkness, and it might not be the darkness of the coronavirus so much, but it might be the darkness of our own sinful behaviors, things that we've done in the past, attitudes that we've had, whatever that may be, that place of darkness. Easter is the time where Christ breaks through and says, death does not have the final word. I am the resurrection. I am the life. He who believes in me will have life and have it to the full. This is a wonderful time to think about how God invites us to move from darkness to life. May this day be a day filled with life and hope, knowing that Christ has the center stage of our life. May you have a very blessed day.